Hello, everybody. How are you all? Who came to the class today? Did you see? Who is that in the class? Today, we have a tiger in the class. Everybody say hi to the tiger children. Who want this tiger? Shall I send this tiger to your home today? A big tiger. Hello, children. How are you all? Hey, what is your name? What is your name? My name is Tiger. Hi, children. Give a high five to the tiger now. The tiger. Say bye to the tiger. Bye, children. Enjoy the class. Very good. Who came to the class today? It's the tiger? Oh my God. I got really scared. So, what is the tiger, children? Tiger is a... Tiger is a... Endangered animal. Tiger is a wild animal which is endangered. Do you know what is the meaning of endangered children? Endangered means it is at a high risk of going to be extinct. We call it endangered. Endangered. So, tiger is an endangered animal. We are at a high risk of... We are at a high risk of losing the tiger's from the world now. Tiger is an endangered animal. It is the danger of going to be extinct. Okay. Okay. Now, children. So, tell me, did you all sleep in the afternoon today? Yes or no? Did you sleep in the afternoon? All right, children. So, everybody should sleep in the afternoon. Okay. It's very healthy for you to sleep in the afternoon. Afternoon nap is very important for you. Okay. That's great. So, now, children, can you tell me which day is today? Today is... Today is Today is Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. Okay. So now, children, can you tell me how many days are there in a week and what are they? There are seven days in a week. Children, can you count and open your seven little fingers now? Yes? Come on, let's count and open seven fingers, okay? Start doing it. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven. So total there are seven days in a week. And what are they? They are, let's quickly go through the weekdays, okay? They are Monday, 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 M-O-N-D-A-Y, Monday, M O N. G A Y Monday. T 
ट्यूजडे 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 वेन्सडे 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 थर्सडे 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 फ्राइडे 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 सैटरडे 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 एंड संडे सो चिल्ड्रेन टोटल देर आर सेवन डेज इन अ वीक एंड दे आर मंडे ट्यूजडे वेन्सडे थर्सडे फ्राइडे सैटरडे संडे द डेज ऑफ द वीक ओके दीज आर द वीक डेज वी हैव ऑल राइट चिल्ड्रेन नाउ come on everybody quickly stand up for the warm up exercise everybody should now stand up for the warm up exercise children come on come on come on stand up for the warm up session stand up hey you what happened stand up very good now come on everybody start jumping jump 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 everybody should jump up high and touch the sky can you really jump up high and touch the sky children come on everybody jump up high and touch the sky good job very good now come on everybody turn around turn around you have to just turn around round and round and round and around like a wind and around and around and around very good come on everybody turn around Good job. Now come on everybody bend forward and touch your toes and then bend backwards as much as possible. Come on children now bend forward and touch your toes and then bend backwards as much as possible. I will count to 8. Okay, you have to do it 8 times. You have to bend down and then bend back. Okay? Start doing it. 1 2 3 4 5 6 6 and 8 very good now all of you put your hands on your hips and rotate your hips round four times clockwise four times anti clockwise come on start doing it everybody put your hands on your hips and rotate your hips round 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 1 2 one more time 1 2 3 4 Five, six, seven, eight. Well done, amazing. Now come on, everybody. Put your hands on your shoulders, children. Tap your shoulders and say one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Well done. Now rotate your elbows round. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good job. Very good, children. Now come on, everybody. Put your hands forward. hands forward and rotate your wrist round 1 2 3 4 now in the other direction 5 6 7 8 8 good job one more time 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 very good children now come on do like this open your fist and make a fist again 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 very good children now come on everybody sit down in your places sit down in your places all of you drink some water if you want okay very good all right so now first let's sing a song today i want you to take a paper and make a roll like this and show it to me once everybody your mics here please 
can you show me your mics like this children show me your mics everybody now are you ready with your mic yes very good now come on start saying okay you have to sing along with me while singing you should remember that you should have a smile on your face like this you should hold your mic firmly right in front of your mouth and the third thing is you should swing your body while singing and the fourth thing is you should sing really loudly okay hi five once again a high five very good children come on let's all start singing the months of the year song okay come on start singing january february march april may june july august september october november december now it's your turn children sing along January February March April May June July August September October November December one more time January February March April May June July August September October November December fantastic children good job now let us sing it quietly quietly means slowly january february march april may june july august september october november december good job now let's all sing it loudly okay come on let's sing it really loud january february march april may june july August, September, October, November, December. One more time. January, February, March, April, May, June, July. August, September, October, November, December. Fantastic children. So, I want you all to learn the song for months of the year. Okay? That's amazing. Now, everybody... clap for eight times and give a high five all right let's do that only eight times okay 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and eight up now can you count for four times and stop come on start counting only four times 1 2 3 4 stop very good now let's all count 14 times and then a stop let's do 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 40 stop good job amazing children okay amazing now what is the next thing we are going to learn for today ta da everybody say hi to aiku hi aiku how are you now it's time for you to learn something what is that what was that aiku can you please tell me in my ears oh Aiko wants to show the phonic sounds of English alphabet. Let's go through it. Okay, here you go. So, children, phonic sounds are very important for you to learn to read quickly. Okay. A, A, A says a a apple. A a apple. A a apple. B b b banana b b banana b b banana C k k cat k k cat k k cat D d d doll 
ड ड डॉल ड ड डॉल ई ई ई इंजन एंड इन सम प्लेसेस इट इज ए ए एग ए ए एग एफ एफ से फिश फिश G G G guitar G G guitar H ha ha helicopter ha ha helicopter ha ha helicopter I I says ice cream ice cream do you want to eat an ice cream now here you go take this one give me money where is the money high five very good next is j j jig j j jig j j jig k says k k kite k k kite k k kite l says l l lion L L lion L L lion M says M mm, M mm, mango M mm, M mm, mango M mm, M mm, mango N says N mm, N mm, nest N mm, N mm, nest N mm, N mm, nest O says O oh, O oh, octopus O oh, O oh, octopus O oh, O oh, octopus P P says p p peacock p p peacock p p peacock. Q says qu qu quill qu qu quill qu qu quill. R R says r r rose r r rose r r rose. Yes yes says. S S San S S San S S San. T says T T Teen T T Teen T T Teen. U says A A Umbrella A A Umbrella A A Umbrella Van. W W says Wa wa watermelon wa wa watermelon wa wa watermelon. X X says x x xylophone x x xylophone x x xylophone. Y Y says ya ya yak ya ya yak ya ya yak. Z Z says z z zip z z zip z z zip. So children, these are the phonic sounds of English alphabet. You should learn the phonic sounds of each and every English alphabet. It's very important for you to blend the sounds and read further. Okay, today I'll show you how. All right. Now this you have seen the capital alphabet. Now I would like to show you the small alphabet as well okay just one second children do you know what is vowels and consonants children how many of you know what is vowels and consonants put your hands up please do you know wow that's amazing now can you tell me what are the vowels in the 26 english alphabet vowels are a e i o u are the five vowels okay now here can you now circle identify and circle the vowels from the given sheet children 
I will hold it like this for you. I, O, U, where is A, A, where is E, E, A, E, I, O, U, these are the ovals and the remaining are the consonants and the remaining alphabets are the consonants okay children you have to remember the vowels and consonants first now can you look at the picture and tell me circle the consonants here can you do this virtual worksheet e not a consonant d yes t yes these are the consonants these are the consonants. Oh, we have five vowels and the remaining are all consonants. Okay, children. Okay, children. So this is how you have to give exercise to your children to identify the vowels and consonants and to circle them just to make sure they understand the concept correctly. Okay. Hope you have really learned this one now hereafter. Vowels and consonants is what you have to identify. Do not forget the five vowels are A, E, I, O, U. Did you observe something else here, children? I'm showing you the small letters. When you do exercises in phonics or anything, you have to do it with small case letters, not with the uppercase letters, okay? A, E, I, O, U. Small case. All right, children. Fine. Next. Now, let's use a. Do you know we use a prefix and before an oval? Let me tell you how. What is this, children? It's an apple. It's an apple. It's an apple. We use a prefix. And before any word that is starting with an oval, okay, it's not a apple because this word is starting with alphabet A, A, E, I, O, U. Any word starting with A, E, I, O, U has a prefix an. We say an apple, an apple. Umbrella, an egg, an owl, an elephant, an ant. Okay, children. So, an, a, n, an, a, n, an. This is how you have to blend two phonemes. Blending two sounds we call a phoneme. An, an, an is used as a prefix for those words which start with vowels A, E, I, O, U. All right, children. Fine. Now here, do you know this? We use A prior to the consonants. Oh, is it so? Yes. Any words that starts with consonants, we use a prefix A. So, you have to say, it's a ball. It's a pencil. It's a doll. It's a fan. It's a, what is this? A lion. It's a cat. But when it comes to the words, which starts with the phonic sounds A, E, I, O, U. We say it's an apple. It's an umbrella. It's an egg. It's an
an owl. It's an elephant. It's an ant. Okay, children. Hope you got the concept clearly. When to use an and when to use a. Look here. When to use an and when to use a. Hope it is clear to you, children. Okay. Words starting with vowels, we use an. Words starting with consonants, we use prefix a. Don't forget this. This is the first grammar lesson for you. Okay. Do you know about this before, children? Very good. This is for L UKG, senior KG. This concept is for senior KG. Now, come on, children, here. So if you have really liked the session, please hit a like. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. We also have online classes happening and I have given the details down in the description box. You can just check and get in touch with us. Okay. All right, children. Now come on here. Which letter is this one? Can you tell me, is it a consonant or an oval, children? It's a, it's a. What is it? It's a vowel. Okay, let's see the words begin. Let's see. Let's learn to build words with the vowel A. B, A, T, bat. B, A, T, bat. R, A, T, rat. K, at cap k ab cap t ab tap h at hat v and van so these are the words which has a sound in it okay children now can you look at these pictures and fill in the blanks what do you think the sound has to be here? What is this, children? Can you tell me what is this? It's an ant. A ant. What is this? It's a bag. And this is a cap. What is this? It's a pan. This is called nap. A short sleep in the daytime we call nap. And here it is a man. Man. So these are the words with sound a uh, in it. Okay. This is how you have to learn the phonic words with a. Uh. Look here closely. K ab cap, d ab dab, f ab fab, g ab gab. So these are the different set of words which has a sound in it. Okay, children, that's okay. Leave that because in book it is not clear now. Now look here. Sight words. Sight words. What are the sight words? Do you know what are the sight words, children? Sight words are those words which has to be remembered by a sight. Looking at it, looking at the word, you have to say the, you have to read out the word. You should not decode a sight word. Those words which we look at it and read out the word, we call it a sight word. And the has. This, that, at, on, in, is, a. These are called the sight words. You should not decode the sight words and read. Okay. You should not say the, a. It's wrong. 
sight words are those words which should not be decoded you have to read it as it is by by sight you have to read the word out that is why it is called sight word sight words are to be memorized you have to memorize the word okay these uh, this here you have a list of 10 sight words you can memorize a and is has in the on this at that okay so these are the sight words that a child has to remember by heart i can say you they have to memorize it and they should not decode the sight words and they have to read out the word as soon as they see the word those are called the sight words okay children in phonics it is also important that you should know the sight words otherwise you cannot decode all the words and read all right children so so in the same way we also have letters with a e i o u words now here i would like to show you blending blending phoneme blending of two sounds we call it phoneme ch 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 okay very good can you tell me look at the picture and tell me what is this children these are the words which starts with the sound ch chain 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 chair 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 chuck 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 chips chips chess chess cheeks cheeks these are all the cha words children these are all the cha words we still have more cha words here which is okay fine not required first i would like to tell you how you have to begin to learn the phonic sounds first is you should learn the letter identification letter identification f h p these are the english alphabet and here did you observe i am showing it in the capital letters so the first step is the child should be able to identify the capital letters after this is over they should identify the small case letters small case letters they should be able to identify the small letters now after they have identified the small letters now the third step is to teach them the phonic sounds of letters so while teaching phonic sounds it is always suggested to go with the small case letters okay when you teach them phonic sound use a small case letter a, a, apple a, a, apple because when they are writing words mostly all the words are with small case letters it will be easy for them to then blend the sounds okay a, a, apple once the phonic sounds of this small case letters is over which is the third step the fourth step is to introduce the fourth step is to introduce vowels and consonants to them because mostly all the three letter words we teach are with vowels only so that is the reason they should understand the vowels and consonants first after this is over words with i words with e all these words with e words with i they have to learn this one after this a e i o u words are over we have to we have so many these are called cvc words okay this information is to parents we, this is called cvc words after a e i o u cvc words are over the fifth thing is to go with the blending these also we have only five ch sh th ng i r that i have already shared in one of my videos how to make your child read quickly in that there is a chart in that you can see all these phonemes ch 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 
after individual sounds are over sh 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 and along with that you also keep training your child with the sight words along with this phonics this is also another part sight words are very important this cannot be decoded as i told to you they have to learn it only by heart they have to memorize sight itself means you have to look at at a sight you should say the name see some other could way would now out make about call her like this is how they have to read sight words should not be decoded okay you sh you cannot read her uh, er, her no sight her is a sight word you just have to read it by heart her okay h e r her now sh ch and we have another two three more i'll show it to you th 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 thumb th th three th th thread th th thorn th th thin th th thorn okay these are the th words children all right and this is wa 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 wheel wa wa wheat wa wa whale wa wa white wa wa whistle these are the wa words children all right long l l l double l we call it as a long l words b all ball wall well bell fell doll you have to learn this one next so like this you have two letter blendings okay once you read the sight words once you read the blendings of two letter words long o and sight words then i will tell you see now you have known the sight word of the english alphabet correct then you have learned the sight words simultaneously then you know where to use a and an now you also know the e a e i o u words once this is done your child will be able to read a sentence i can show you here how L look at this please let's learn to read and write sentences starting with this this is a sight word so your child should be able to do this this is 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 again a sight word he already knows is a is a sight word b ball l controlled word in that list they might have learnt ball this is a ball your child can read this and in the same way when you make them by heart these phonic sounds you also should have taught them with spelling t h i s d s i s e s a because these are the sight words then obviously the child will also write it so easily so this is how they will read and write sentences so hope this concept is clear for you all this is a bag this is is sight words a bag ag words when we teach a sound a words bag ag that is one they will this is a bag child can read a sentence again this is my doll this is a cow o w did you see here this is o words a uh, a uh, a e i o u this is my house ow o u ow words house this is my dog a uh, ow words so this is how we will make kids learn to write sentences and read sentences very easily so this is this one which i am showing here a ukg child will be doing they will be able to read sentences and they will be able to write simple sentences how you have to go stage wise i have showed you right that is how you have to teach kids learning to read and write quickly and easily once this much is done 
by six years, your child will almost know so many sight words and so many words and all. It will be very easy for them to read small, small story books and so and so forth from first class onwards. Reading is not at all a problem for them. So hope I'm very clear to you. This is a very important topic. I thought I'll share with you from a very long time now. This that that is again a sight word is my car. Uh, a word. This is a car. That is my pillow. That is my son. Okay. That is my school. So now I can tell you here something else. For example, sometimes the child might not know this as garden. For example, they don't know how to read this as garden. Then how will they understand? That is a, since they are seeing the picture here, they will automatically understand, Acha, this might be the picture. This might, this word is starting with ga. Here I can see a garden. Then this is the garden. That is how they will understand and read. That is my school van. So this is how kids will learn to read quickly and easily. They also will read these sentences and they also will write the sentences. After that is over, another English, another English concept is to learn singular and plural. So children look here, singular and plural. If there is one object, you have to say apple. If there is more than one, we have to say apples. You just have to add yes to the word given okay adding yes and es concept is also there that is not required now okay apple apples one we call star more than one we call stars one pencil two pencils one girl two girls so this is the concept of singular and plural. Okay. Now what they have to. Now what they have to do. They have to learn to write the sentence with capital. They have to capitalize the first letter of a sentence. Next a child will learn to capitalize the first letter of the sentence. This is my bag all the letters has to be small case only the first letter has to be capitalized okay children this is what you have to learn next then comes the punctuations question marks all these are there in the all these are there for a ukg student okay children this is the concept of phonics. That is how you will be able to learn to read and write very easily and quickly if you go step by step. Otherwise, you will not learn to read so quickly here. I will randomly show you the small case phonic alphabet. Just try and test how many of you can say the phonic sounds correctly. Okay. N. Mm. Mm. Next. A, a, apple, j, j, joker, g, g, goat, b, b, bat, h, h, horse, a, a, elephant, L, L, lamp. X, 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 mostry. P, P, parrot. Qua, Qua, queen. Qua, Qua, queen. Wa, Wa, watch. It's like this. It's not watch. It's watch. Wa, wa, watch. F, f, fish. F, f, fish. 
t t tomato t t tomato t t tomato d d dog d d dog d d dog y y yacht y y yacht y y yacht e e igloo e e igloo e e igloo r r rabbit r r rabbit r r rabbit z z zebra z z zebra z z zebra mm mm monkey mm mm monkey mm mm monkey s s sun s s sun s s sun k k kite k k kite k k kite o o orange o o orange o o orange v v violin v v violin v v violin all right children and here you go k k cat k k cat k k cat so this is how you have to teach the phonics sounds to children in the small case letters all right children so if you have liked this session please hit a like button and if you are looking to enroll your child for our online classes i have already given the details in the description box below you can get in touch with us we are going to start batches from this month june okay so this is how we teach our students in the school and our junior kg senior kg students will read story books very easily by the end of the year and it will be very easy for them when they go to the first standard and now children come on everybody open your drawing notebooks let's do some drawings today we are going to draw something for since we have done the phonics class today today we will draw something related to all the letters okay a for what you have to draw a for a for a, a. a, a apple a, a apple a, a apple can you draw a apple children can you, a apple or an apple is it a apple or is it an apple it's an apple it's an apple very good what shall we draw for b b says b says b b ball 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 C says k k cup k k cup so children after this video is over you can also see after this video is over you can also go back and check this one you can also go back and check this video and learn these drawings slowly okay what is d d for d for what you want me to draw i'll draw something and you just tell me what is that okay what is this children can you tell me
d d duck d d duck d d duck d d duck e for egg f for what is this f for fish very good so children learn to draw the drawings for all the english alphabet a to z okay that is very important for you to uh, you know what learn to draw f g for g for g g grapes h for ha ha hat i for ice cream j for j for jig k for k for kite l for l for what is this children l for lamp m for mask face mask m for mask okay next is n look at these drawings children a b k d a f g h i j k l m now let's draw n n for n for can you tell me what is this one nest o for o for octopus p for p for P for parrot. Parrot. Q for Q for quill. quill r for
रोज रोज यस फर वेरी इजी फॉर यू यस फर सन टी फर टी फर टी फर टी फर tub tub the bath tub u for umbrella v for v for vase flower vase W for W for watch X for X for X must be वाइफर 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 याट वाइफर yat okay and z for z for zip 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 yeah so children i want you all to draw learn to draw pictures for each and every alphabet okay that way you can learn 26 different drawings all right children so hope you have really liked the drawing class today after this session is over you can go back and pause and learn all these drawings okay children these are so very easy drawings you can do it on your own and you can learn drawing one every day or at least two three every day all right children fine so hope you have really enjoyed today's session so it's already one hour now we don't have time for the story actually i got a story for you a beautiful story see it's rehan's secret adventure but this is a very long story so this will not it will take time today so i'll do this in wednesday's class so till then don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel for those who are new to my channel please subscribe to my channel if you have liked this class today please hit a like button and if you are planning to join your kids in our classes then i have given the details in the description box below please get in touch with me but i am requesting you not to call because calls are not accepted you have to send a whatsapp message hope you got that send a whatsapp message so take care bye children have a nice day see you on wednesday's class again bye